welcome back you guys it's been a minute since i picked up my camera but 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 i did try to vlog for you guys a couple days ago on sunday we actually went to the swap meet with the family and my sd card completely went to shit i don't know what it is with me and sd cards but i constantly have to change them buy new ones they always give me like an error message or they just completely mess up i don't know if it's this adapter that i have my sister actually borrowed it and it messed up her clips like a couple weeks ago and i haven't had it in a few months so when she gave it back to me i started using it again and i really think my sd cards just mess up with this type of like adapter that i have i don't freaking know but i have another one so i'm not too worried i actually just got this one in the mail literally like five minutes ago you guys and i have been waiting to vlog all freaking week because i haven't had an sd card and i know what y'all are thinking girl you look like shit but i feel better and that's all that freaking matters <laughs> what happened can we snack <laughs> did you miss your brother you guys i am on like my fourth day here and i'm really trying not to wash it as often because i started noticing my hair getting like super oily i was washing it almost every day for like a week i'm just trying to get it into like a better routine with not having to wash it every day because literally not even 24 hours would pass and i would start feeling like the top getting a little greasy even though it was like not even a day old so yeah i'm on day four but today's hair wash day so please ignore my hair until i wash it later <laughs> i already went to go pick up evan and chubbs i have to go pick up nana elijah right now i will catch you guys when i come back from picking them up because i have about five minutes until i leave and i've been yapping and yapping okay guys don't mind the angle i know i look freaking crazy but it is currently 4 11 i just got back from picking up all the kids from school it is wednesday usually i have a house full but my boy's grandma which is my baby daddy's mom she actually called me yesterday and was like hey can i pick up the boys like i miss them i haven't seen them on the weekend in a couple weeks now and i wanted to see if i can like spend some time with them and i was like of course so she just came to pick them up but elijah was like oh i want to go too which is our third boy and obviously that's not his grandma that's the boy's grandma through their dad but like we said family's family and they freaking love all of them so yeah guys they took all three boys and they're actually gonna go hang out over there for a couple hours until my husband gets off of work so i have about two hours with just me and the girls but yeah i freaking love her she brought me medicine because she knew how sick i was last week and she was like you should have told me like i have some really good like antibiotics and all this stuff from mexico so yeah she brought me a little care package picked up all three boys i'm gonna shower Get myself together. I'd be lying if I didn't say I haven't washed my hair in like four days. <laughs> I wash my ass twice a day, morning and night. But I haven't washed my hair in like four days. So I'm going to wash my hair. I'm going to do like a little reset on myself. And yeah, it's just me and the girls. Nana is actually hanging downstairs with a baby girl. And they're going to watch a movie. So mom's going to have a little bit of a long time before I get started on dinner. Okay, guys. I am out of the shower. I finally don't smell like duro. Guys, little story time that freaking happened two nights ago. It was actually on Monday and we were cooking babe was actually in the kitchen with me baby girl and we were literally almost done with dinner you guys all i had to do was warm up some corn because we were making like at home like mashed potato famous bowl kfc vibes if you know you know we were making those little bowls and all i had to do was heat up like the corn and i have baby girl on the counter with me every single time i cook like she is always with me helping me cook doing her little thing i always try to make her feel like she's involved because if not she'll literally just cry at my feet and wait for me to freaking pick her up so she's always with me while i'm cooking you guys and i looked away for like half a second babe was doing something on the stove and tell me why baby girl literally stuck her finger inside of the can of corn you guys i instantly started freaking out because her finger was like stuck in there was not moving and i was trying to like open the can and babe was like no like don't open it that way because then you're just gonna like dig her finger like deeper so he like squeezed the whole can so that it like had enough space to get her finger out but by that time you guys like her finger was already freaking cut and at first we were like oh it's fine like it's just a cut like 
it'll stop bleeding but after like 10 or 15 minutes it didn't freaking stop you guys if anything it got worse and my husband is super chill and doesn't freak out for anything but when i asked him i'm like babe you think we need to take her to the emergency room and he was like oh i think so like it's starting to swell and right then and there i knew that we had to take her because like i said you guys my husband doesn't freak out with anything he's always like oh like they're fine like it's not that bad but he said since it was baby girl he got a little more scared and because it was getting swollen so yeah we had to rush her to the emergency room and i felt like absolute shit you guys because obviously that could have been prevented and I just felt like a horrible freaking mom. I know it was an accident and she was just curious. Even though it could have been prevented, I didn't want to keep like beating myself up over it. But yeah, we ended up taking her to the hospital. And I'm just going to answer the little clip here. Have you ever been to the library? I have it all. Can you see that? Elias, it's currently 9 at 12 p.m. And we had to rush to the emergency room because I'm a bad mom. Do you have a house that long, bro? You guys were cooking, and I always have a lay on the counter with me. And I had a can of corn open, but it wasn't like fully open, so she stuck her finger in the can, and it got stuck and started bleeding. So here we are. My baby. So yeah, they're about to glue her fingers. But yeah guys, since my sister literally lives right by the emergency room, we just took the boys over there. My poor baby girl, I just felt so bad that we had to take her in. She did really good. As soon as we got there, they gave her like a little like purple like bear. And she was just happy that she had a little stuffed animal. From the time that we checked in to the time that we got discharged, we were only there for one hour. So it was really fast, but... I just felt more bad. They glued up her finger, got her all set to go. And yeah, her finger's looking good. It's fine. They said that even if we didn't bring her in, like it wasn't that bad and as deep as we thought. But yeah, they just put some glue on there to make sure everything healed a little bit faster. But yeah, guys, I swear having kids, it's like always something. And I was so freaking scared, but we're all good. Baby girl's good. Finger is healing and... That's all that matters. Hello, honey. Hi. It is currently 5.38 right now. I know my stove back here says 4.38, but it's been wrong for months, so don't mind that. So I'm gonna get started on dinner. The house feels a little weird because it's so quiet in here. Yes, baby. Hi. Outside? Yeah. You wanna go outside? Yeah. Okay. As you guys heard, babe girl is actually right here. She's gonna be playing with chalk while I cook dinner. And don't mind all the sodas, you guys. My husband went to the store a couple days ago and he dropped like the whole case of soda. So one of them was broken and leaking everywhere. So yeah, I still haven't put this away. Don't mind that. But I'm gonna make an easy dinner, you guys. Bye, Bye girl. Babe got home with all the boys. They all showered. I'm gonna serve everybody. We're gonna enjoy some dinner. Me and babe already dug in, but these are our plates. It is so delicious. We already tried it. Good morning, you guys. It's actually the next morning. It's currently 7:30, and I just finished babe's breakfast, lunch, coffee. Now I need to shower. The boys are getting ready for school, and I'm gonna hurry up and brush my teeth, wash my ass, and get this fucking day started. I have about like 10, 15 minutes before we have to go take the boys, so let's go. I literally wear like the same five shirts if I'm not going somewhere. I wear like the same five motherfucking shirts, so <laughs> don't mind that. Good morning, mom. Come here. Hey. You hear your dad? Say hi, dad. Say good morning, dad. Good morning. Good morning. Can you say bubble? No. 
Be nice. You seen your teta? Here you go. You're welcome. Okay, you guys, nice and loaded up. Now to go drop off Elijah. I already dropped off Evan and Chubbs like 30 minutes ago. But y'all already know I have to go to different schools. So and now to head over to Elijah's school. Okay, let's go. Love you more. Have a good day, be good. See you after school. Love you more. Okay, guys, I just dropped off Elijah now to head back home. Go, my diamond girl. like ending the car ride with a little worship music we're home <laughs> let's go mama okay come on oh. we're home little grandma Woo. you guys i made a little concoction well i bought everything and then my husband put everything together with my brother-in-law it's literally a laundry detergent. I seen it on TikTok. Well, actually, my sister sent it to me. We got all like the little cleaning products. There was like five or six of them that you have to buy to mix together. So yeah, I bought everything, and it's been lasting me already like three weeks, you guys. Usually, I buy one of these jars like every week just because we have a big, big family. And I was going through so much freaking soap. Guys, sorry if the wash is so loud, but I was going through this so freaking fast. So we got that. We're already on like week three, and we have so much left. So 10 out of 10 recommend you guys if you have a big family. Hey. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> I feel like I constantly have to fold laundry like every freaking day. <laughs> Don't mind the mess. You got your pancakes? Yeah? I made a baby girl some pancakes. Are they buzzing? Can I try it? I just yeah. folded all the whites. This wasn't supposed to be in there, but it ended up in there somehow. Yeah. But I usually <laughs> I usually wash all of our white clothes throughout the house together just because there's never that much. But we got it done, girl. Yeah.